In this problem, we're going to evaluate this indefinite integral. So the first thing we want to do is write everything as x to a power. So note, if you have the square root of x, there's really a 1 here and a 2 here. And the way it works is it's always x, and it's this number over this number, so it's 1 over 2. Over here, we have a cube root of x. And again, there's really a 1 here. And again, it's always this number over this number. So in this case, it's 1 over 3. As a first step, let's go ahead and make those substitutions. So we have the integral of parentheses 6x to the 1 half plus 1 over x to the 1 third parentheses dx. Okay, so now let's keep going and let's finish writing everything as x to a power. So this is done, but this one is not because it's downstairs. So what we'll do is I'll write down the first one again. So 6x to the 1 half. And then we're going to bring this one upstairs. And when you do that, the exponent becomes negative. See, now it's a negative 1 third. All right. So now we can use the power rule. So the power rule basically says um, we just add 1 to the exponent and divide. So this will be 6x. Let's see, we're taking 1 half and we're adding 1. So 1 half plus 1 is the same as 1 half plus 2 halves, which is the same as 3 halves. So this is x to the 3 halves, and then we divide by 3 halves. Plus. Now we're taking negative 1 third and we're adding 1. So negative 1 third plus 1. That's the same thing as negative 1 third plus 3 thirds. Then you add negative 1 plus 3 is 2, so you get 2 thirds. This is x to the 2 thirds, and then you divide by 2 thirds, okay? And then plus c. Eventually you can do these uh, computations in your head. What you definitely don't want to do is you don't want to do them here, okay? You want to do them on the side. A lot of times I see that people first learning integration, they try to do it like in the problem. It makes it really messy. Okay, whenever you divide by 3 halves, you really multiply by the reciprocal of 3 halves. So the reciprocal of 3 halves is just 2 over 3. So this is 2 over 3 times 6x to the 3 halves. Same thing here. We're dividing by 2 thirds. So we multiply by the reciprocal of 2 thirds, which is 3 halves. So plus 3 halves x to the 2 thirds and plus c. All right, almost done. Notice the 3 can go into the 6 twice. So 2 times 2 is 4. So this is 4x to the 3 halves plus 3 halves x to the 2 thirds plus c. Boom, there it is. Beautiful problem. I hope this video has been helpful. Good luck.